Ooh, ooh, ooh. I almost pushed the wrong button. Hello, everyone. Face of here. Welcome to some more Pillars of the Earth. Um, I don't believe we're going to be finishing it today. I believe it'll probably be finished tomorrow. Um, and at that point, I need to figure out what to play because we're going to be putting Sekiro on slight hold to see if it goes on sale this month. Because uh, Steam Summer Sale is coming right up this month. And, uh, you know, <laughs> we like saving money. How's it going, Moira? Welcome to the stream, my friend. How you doing? I am stinking tired, my friend. I finished my tea already. I just sat here. Ugh. Getting old sucks, my friends. Ugh. Neck. Throw my neck this weekend. It's popped and... Teeth and throat are all sore. Ugh, it's awful. Friend. It's a space! How's it going, space? Welcome to the stream! Just sitting around for like nine hours in a while waiting for an NPC to maybe respawn. Oh my god! Did you look up the NPC? Because some of them have like a week's long respawn time. And it's really awful. I just realized it said it was waiting for me to push a button. That's annoying. The white ship. She was one of the fastest vessels that was ever built. No, oh, that's the, the Black who Pearl. The king of the English now, the son of King Henry, was on board when she this sailed. This is the beginning off. of the the and series. The prince, there were because I, I I tried to start the series and I was like I I'm falling asleep. I can't watch this. From Normandy to England. That sounded like this show sucks. I don't know. I was going to bed originally. I was like, oh, I'll put on the series. I'm like, I'm Even falling asleep. I'll, I will not departed, understand what the hell is happening. So I had, his had men to something I could fall asleep to. Monks that were meant to bless the voyage were then forced to disembark. Some say the ship had been cursed. The king's son and many of his family. If he didn't get in a giant, get now pack him out. Nice. The Black Sea that night. The only time I've ever uh, spawn, I guess camped, a spawn in WoW was way back in vanilla days when hunter pets actually had You're their own individual one stats. Detail. Not only these monks, and I sat Stephen of Blois, at a point nephew, on my hunter embarked, that say he got or Ill. Broken Tooth, his name was Broken Tooth, and he had like a week Stephen and a half spawn time. The king of the it was bananas what? to catch him because he had like the most or the quickest yes, attack speed in the game. Of course he's king now. And I liked PvP he at the time. Survived. He is the king's nephew. So I what sat there think, and I, I ran into I him on like day three or four. And like I spawned in, I went to go check it, and he was there, but a fucking maid showed up and killed him before I got to tame him, and I was really upset. But then I knew the cooldown time, and I was able to get him on his next spawn. But man, that was annoying. <gasps> Kami, how's it going, friend? Welcome to the stream. I love your side duck. A proper country where people know how to behave. A proper country. Oh yeah, we have a kid now. What about you? Why are you leaving? I had no reason to stay. I'm looking for someone. I'm looking for someone. For who? My boyfriend. Uh, I, I guess I should stay out of other people's business. Forgive me. You English do talk a lot, don't you? Is he not English? I just don't know how to feel about leaving my country for the first time. I mean, how should anyone feel? Hopeful? I don't know. Maybe I'm just running away. A hard time not thinking these seagulls mine. You should all get some rest. It will not be long now. Who is this guy? Shobo. Thank the Lord. Some new dude. Wait to be back. Also, I realized somehow Jada, the little the little Jada emo right there got hidden on my seams. I don't know how long it was hidden. I was making uh, the paintings. I was, I'm trying to make a painting overlay for when we do the mini paint stream. And when I copied my scene and I was going through the stuff to get rid of the ones I don't need, I, know, I noticed that that one was hidden. I was like, oh my God, how long has that one been hidden for? Bring the Jada back. So we got the Jada back. Mm -hmm. Oh, holy crap. Uh, I'm 
little tired. Turn it down ever so slightly because it's stinking loud sometimes. Have these intros in the other books i don't remember them maybe they got like a lot more funding because the as time went on they got a lot more popular so they were able to add a little more polish not sure <sighs> sorry chapter 15 Schoenberg, Normandy. In the summer of 1142, I had left my home country, England, for good. My old life lay in shambles. I really like her name. That's pretty. Kingsbridge. Having failed both my friends and family, I had set out to find my baby's father, the man I still loved with all my heart, Jack Jackson. And so early one morning in July, I finally arrived on the shores of Normandy. With nothing on me but a pouch of coin and a young, curious face yet unnamed, who was just as unfamiliar to this new world as was I. The white ship was one of the fast. That's probably what they read, right? Yeah, I think pretty sure. Pretty sure that's what they was just read. What's up, dude? You're still here. Oh, it's you. I'm just it trying may. to get my feet used to good solid ground again. The last bit of our voyage wasn't exactly my pint of ale. You're Mason, right? That hammer you're carrying, do you happen to be a Mason? Actually, I am. You have a keen eye, mistress. <laughs> I see you noticed my hammer. Oh, you mean my real hammer. To be honest, I haven't been one long. Just finished my apprenticeship in Salisbury. Before that, I used to shear sheep with my parents. But I guess that wasn't really for me. Father still hates me for leaving, though. Where would a mason go to find work? I left my old life as well. I'm looking for someone. I'm looking for someone. A red-haired mason called Jack Jackson. Kind of looks like an older version of this baby that I'm holding. A fellow mason. Great. Unfortunately, I wouldn't know a thing. After all, I just arrived here with you. I know. I keep an eye out. Should you meet someone like that on mm -hmm. your journey, mm -hmm. tell him Aliena of Shiring is looking for him. All right. Jack Jackson. I'll keep an eye out Jack for Jack Jackson. You. Thank you. His last name just means son of Jack, so it's Jack, son of Jack. Very helpful. What will you do to find work here as a mason? Don't know. That's for me to find out. All I heard was that the wages are better over here. So you'll just travel from town to town and look for employment. I <laughs> like the oh, guy in the boat here. It's <laughs> just a fellow Mason told me about the Abbey there. He said these he hasn't moved in two minutes. Church is quite differently than we do back home. I need to see the guy behind him has, though. Maybe learn a thing or two. Swabbing the poop deck. What does that mean? What does swabbing the poop deck mean? Does anyone know what that means? Abbey and Lassay. Do many Masons go there? Do many Masons go to Lesay? Ah, I don't know. It's really just a tiny town. The Mason who told me just happened to do some repairs there once. It's likely he told others as well. I left my old life as well. Scary, isn't it? Nah. To start fresh and all that. Well, you definitely sound more excited than scared. Oh, I am excited. Wouldn't anyone be? Uh, you just uh, said I it'd be know. scary. Maybe. Bye. Have a safe journey. Oh, thank you. You too. Ah, uh, he's a nice dude. Okay. I need to find Jack. Check out Lassay. I have baby. I won't give the baby a name until I found Jack. I still have the book. I still have my dad's stabby bit. Hello. We got a stall. We got another stall. Not Jack. <laughs> I have to. Hello, not Good Jack. Day. 
I am looking for someone. He has hair just like yours. Who came through here last summer. Oh, hush now. I need to talk to this man. Looks young. He was born at the beginning. You're observant. What's his name? I haven't given him one yet. You should. He needs to know who he is. He's a fucking newborn. A lot easier. You said you're looking for someone. Yes. Looks a bit like you. Yeah. The man I'm looking for looks a bit like you, actually. Uh oh. A bit more boyish, though. So he has red hair, but no beard. Mm. Well, I don't know every redhead around these parts. <laughs> there are quite a few of us. Most of my family here in Sherbrooke is ginger. Oh, his name is Jack Jackson, and he is a mason. Hmm. No. no I like how they I haven't changed his name. It's still not Jack. And I come here every day. Or maybe a May saw him. She helps the sailors get their cargo to the nearby towns. It carries travelers, too. A May. I'll ask her. Thank you. Thanks, dude. Appreciate the help, not Jack. Ugh, easy. Woo! Oh. Hello. Coachwoman. Is that a May? She... Alright, I guess we'll talk to her. Hello. Hey, you. Hi. That's quite a bundle you got there. Where are you headed? Uh, have you seen him? Have you seen a red-haired mason? He must have landed here sometime late last summer. <laughs> Another ginger in Normandy? I wouldn't have noticed, even if he was carrying a hammer instead of a fishing rod. Maybe you should ask someone in Barfleur. That's where oh my god, so many places. Through, the pilgrims and kings. Their lot rarely lands in Cherbourg with the fortress passing back and forth between Stephen of Blois and Geoffrey of Anjou. Why you even came to Cherbourg in the first place baffles me. It was the earliest ship I could get. He must be in some hurry, madam. Let's just say I needed to get away before I changed my mind. <laughs> Fine with me. Who am I to judge? Oh my god. Okay. Uh... What other routes are there besides going through Barfleur? Oh, I don't know, really. You need to ask the locals about that. Oh, and man. Barfleur Did that just unlock everything? Place to start. Shake my hand and I'll take you there. Do you know the road to Lesse? Been there, seen it. But I hope you're not planning to go there on foot. Tell you what, you give me some coins and I'll treat you to me wagon. You can even change your destination once we're on the road, what'd you say? Oh, that's nice. Uh, I'm gonna leave the conversation for a minute. Traveling by coach is a lot less strenuous than walking. Your little worm deserves some warmth and a rocking carriage. I'm worried she's gonna try to sell me into slavery. Changed your mind, madam? You know, I reserved a cozy spot just for you. Yeah, see, you're freaking me out now. All right. Take me out of town. All right. Where'd you need to be? Oh, boy. Where are we going? Oh, boy. Honfle. Let's go to... Uh... I want to go to Lassay, but our blue is right here, we so. We to Barfleur, a scenic port town built on granite. It was the biggest harbor in Normandy, and the main entry point for the Normans to their new possession of the Isle of England. I talked to some of the sailors and fishermen, but no one had remembered seeing Jack. How could they? Almost a year had passed since he, a simple mason, had journeyed through the busy town, a town with no memory other than that of the last king who passed through on yet another one of his violent conquests. Maybe I was approaching this the wrong way. What had drawn him to France in the first place? The distance to Kingsbridge? Or something specific? What was my lead? Shh. 
shit. All right, I'm going over here. The say was tiny, but as it turned out, worth the trip. In the small abbey church of the Trinity, I met a monk who claimed to have talked to a man fitting Jack's description. He'd been fascinated by the abbey's rib vaulting and had asked the monks countless questions about the place's construction. The monk apologized that he couldn't tell me where Jack had traveled next, but I didn't mind. So, are we sure that he saw him? I lay down to sleep on the floor of the abbey guest house and, for the first time in almost a year, I felt relief. As I drifted into sleep, I hugged our baby tight and whispered into his tiny pink ear, we're going to find your daddy. There's this creepy portrait. Hold on. Behind the doggo cam. You see that? <laughs> just this dude. Oh. Is it in every corner? Because the one where my cam is doesn't look nearly as terrifying. And neither does the one on the top right. Are they the characters? Because the one on the top right looks like Aliena. And the one in the top left looks like the other mason that died. I don't know about the other two. Oh crap, I can't go to Har Floor anymore. Le Mans. My father had once told me tales of the Mont Saint Michel. Long ago. The Archangel Michael had urged Hubert of Avranche to build an abbey on a lonely rock on the ocean by burning a hole into his head. They say one can go and see his penetrated skull on display in the church of his hometown. Holy crap. It was a windy day when I arrived, and the place was crowded with pilgrims. Pilgrims and jongleur. What's jongleur? I remember Jack's fascination with these tellers of stories. So why is there a space? Oh, you guys can barely see it, but as it happened, this eye has an extra space before it. Although not in Mont Saint Michel, but on a road heading east from there. Okay, red heading east. Road heading east from Mont Saint Michel. Jack had been hopelessly tracking Jongleur, who might have known his father, Jack Sherberg, but as he'd been gradually running out of money. He'd intended to look for work in Le Mans or Tours. Okay, I guess we're going to Le Mans. About six months ago, I was catching up. Let's go this way. Oh my God. How much money am I paying this lady? Going to Le Mans reminded me of all the trouble I'd left behind in England. 30 years ago, Le Mans had been conquered by the Plantagenet Geoffrey of Anjou, Maud's husband. And although they'd held it ever since, other noble families kept on pulling at the city, like Maud and Stephen tearing at England. There was no sign of Jack, but I got news of a new kind of cathedral being built in Saint-Denis, just north of Paris. It was possible that Jack had gone there to learn from the craftsmen. That was, if he hadn't traveled further south, looking for work in one of the many churches in Tours, the hometown of Saint-Martin. Oh, God. That's so far to go, though. All right. Oh. Did I find him? This guy looks happy. Hello. Bird. Church design, pointy arch, construction site, important looking man, statue of Mother Mary. Hey dude, have you seen Jack? Right? Good day, are you the master builder? What is it? I'm looking for a mason who may have passed through. A little here. baby. An Englishman with carroty hair. He calls himself Jack Jackson. Hmm, a redhead. Yes. Did you see him? He might have asked for work here. No, no, I I'm not looking for new masons. We're just doing repairs. 
That's not what I asked. Here. No, never seen him. Now, stand back, woman. Something could fall on your baby's head. You're suspicious as fuck. I told they came here. Are there the other construction sites around tour? May I talk to your workers? I was told he came here. I was told he wanted to come here. Well, maybe he changed his mind. Are you sure you haven't seen him? I am. Hmm. You hesitated when I mentioned a redhead. Are you sure you haven't seen him? Yes, I am sure. Yeah, you're just like, yeah, I don't believe you, but we'll ask him. Are there other construction sites around Tor? Well, yes, it's a big town. And where would an outsider most likely find a job? Don't know. Ask around. Grumpy face. I am asking around, yes, monkey. <sighs> all right, all right, he was here. Thank you. He was working for me. But I had to throw him out. Why wouldn't you fucking tell me that? Why? Because he was all want, want, want. Let me redesign the roof. Let me make the nave lighter. All pretty ideas, but he never shut up long enough to do the work he was supposed uh, that to That sounds like Jack. Shit, that man was almost as needy as my son when he was still a brat. Mm, he does know a lot about his craft. Well, I know Masons like him. They grow up gifted, but without a moat of discipline in their guts. Can't work with someone like that. Yeah, can't you put your ego aside at all, oh, can you? No What's up, Josh? <laughs> Uncle M. Maybe even to La Rochelle. Seemed to have plans for every cathedral on God's green earth, but none for himself. I understand. I'll leave you to it then. Bon voyage. See, was that so hard? Oh, fuck, man. All right. I'm guessing he's in Dol Rochelle. Oh, man, I look I rough. Dizzy. I stopped and made rest, trying to catch my breath, then lost my breakfast in a ditch at the side of the road. Uh-oh. To my horror, our baby, too, had grown pale. Oh, no! Like that of an old man. I tried not to panic. But the next inn was a long distance away, and we couldn't stay on the road where oh, it was man. So cold. Started a playthrough as a half drought fighter. In Baldur's Gate 3? Holy crap, dude. Too many enemies only had nine health. Just a bad time. Well, I mean, you're supposed to pick up your friends along the way, Moira. To make it easier. Remember the brain and the body at the very beginning we crushed? I saved it. Joins you as a companion has twenty one Really? Holy crap, that's a lot of life. <sighs> Fuck, we gotta head back and rest. Back in tour, the fever got worse. I remember people Shit, we're gonna lose our baby! Laying me on a bed. I tried to feed Well those brain baby. bugs do a crap ton of damage, makes sense. Into a blur. It adds more spicy dialogue with people you encounter. <laughs> That's awesome. When I awoke, Jack was standing. Next Holy to me. shit, he here! Or am I hallucinating slash dreaming? Him. You know you could go anywhere you want. He whispered, "Why be stupid and follow me?" I believe I'm dreaming. I tried to answer, but he just opened the window and jumped out, heading toward ancient Greece, or maybe all the way to Arabia. And in my feverish mind, I followed him. <sighs> it was a hallucination. Fuck. It's fine. It's not fine. We're gonna lose our baby. Oh god, look how... Oh, I look rough, guys. Uh... Uh, man, if we lose her, I'm going to be very upset. I don't know which way to go, dude. 
Like, Arabia has cooler buildings. I can see him wanting to go there. But this is shorter. Oh, fuck, man. Definitely gonna lose the baby. The further I went, the angrier I got. For years, I'd been fighting for my family. I'd committed myself to an oath to my father. I'd built up a business to sustain it and even married a man I despised so I could create a future for the people around me. I'd know nothing but my duty to the men in my life, while the man I was trying to find live a life of casual irresponsibility. He traveled the world on a whim to learn about mathematics and philosophy, while I had to... No, 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 I'm pretty sure this is all a fever dream. When could I ever do anything just for myself? I asked the world as I went on. Fuck. Wait, what? No! What? Yeah, this has to be, like, a dream. Because that's bananas. Traveled in a circle all the way to the edge of the world. Yeah, I'm dreaming. Only to return to the place of our failure. With my eyes closed, I listened to the sound of ripping yarn and crumbling walls, and of coaches carrying good people away into a cloud of crimson dust. Okay. Yeah, nightmare. Whew. When the last moat had settled, I opened my eyes again and found myself in a dirty little room. An old maid was sitting next to my bed and smiled at me then oh, okay he's still baby. he's still breathing that's a good sign oh dear god he still looked so pale shit feed him fatten him up i tried to feed him but he refused oh oh please god let him live no him for my i don't sins. want i gently caressed his head until finally he put his mouth to my breast and drank okay, and yeah, drank dude. More eat up, more, like. Becoming greedier with every. Nom sport. nom 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 nom. Mommy milkers, get them. We had both been spared. We rested one more day, then I gathered my things and headed back to the cathedral to oh. thank the Lord for His mercy. They're not just for show; they're working breasts. Launch away. Oh. This is meant to be relieving and touching. <laughs> My brain gets in a state of panic, all right? <laughs> and, oh, it's, I need some sort of, like, pressure valve release. Otherwise, I panic and get stressed out. I need to thank the Lord for sparing... Oh, God. Uh, I need... Sure. Uh, pointy this arch. A good place for praying. Don't tell me that. Oh, here. I thank you, dear Lord. All right, steady now. I thank now. you for having spared my child. I thank you for... Don't let go until it's done. He's going to show up, isn't he? <gasps> move, 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 move. Oh, dude, that actually legit made my heart pound. I failed Jack. I failed my brother. And if I never return, I would also break the oath. I I'm cold. You guys, I don't know if you can see it, but I have it's goosebumps. Just, oh, my God. It's just that I feel like I've never had Woo! a life of my own. I've always fought for others, and this may be the very first time oh to fight for something that I only want for myself. Maybe I should just go back and help rebuild Kingsbridge. Maybe Jack doesn't even care for me anymore. Nah, Jack don't seem like that kind of dude. Amen. Huh. That definitely looks like Jack's statue, bruh. Excuse me. I've seen one of those before. It's amazing, isn't it? The man who did that really had it in him. I knew him once. Where is he? I agree. He always did. Oh, you knew Master Jacques. Yes, but it's been a while. We found him. I last saw him. It's a shame that the master. Let Lonnie, him hey friend, welcome to the stream. So How come your sound effect didn't go off? Why didn't your sound effect go off? Bruh. Also, did no one else's sound effect go off? Hold on. Because I forgot to put the check mark. There you go. Say something again. Also, y'all know what time it is. 
Our stream boss has entered chat. Welcome back to the channel, my friend. Our favorite stream boss, CK Lani. How you doing, my friend? Welcome, welcome. Appreciate you popping in. Uh, I thought he left after three days. See, that dude lied. Oh, no. The master builder said he fired him after just three days. There you go. Sound effect. <sighs> Did he? Well, maybe that's how he remembers it. The two didn't really see eye to eye, you know? To tell you the truth, everyone thinks that he feels... See, I told you it was an ego thing. Like there was no reason for him to the lie to me. thing Jack did was carve that corbel. It was the one thing the master let him do. Then when he was done, he was asked to leave. Your master said he had no discipline. <laughs> <laughs> let me tell you something. Jacques worked very hard on it. He was impatient and had a temper, but you could see that he tried to overcome it. See? He's Conquering a good dude. That rock was very important to him. Oh, I understand that so well. Do you happen to know where he went next? He wanted to walk the pilgrim trail to Santiago de Compostela. The Camino? The way of St. James? Are we he getting an El Camino? Someone there who knew his father. Drop Just top load. Thing. Ride How was he when fat he... rims. Let's go. Hmm. Never thought about that. Relieved, I guess. He seemed ready for something new. Thank you so much for your help. Think nothing of it. And good luck on your travels. May you find what you are looking for. You are much kinder than your boss. Thank you. Isn't it odd? Russian? Just when you stop looking, you come across the most curious of things. Like these three devices that one of my merchants brought back. Oh, I thought the I statue died. right there was a really tiny person at first. <laughs> oh, Woo! No. Is it another one of your Banu Musa toys, Rashid? What's a Banu Musa toy? Toys, Avriel. They're objects of scholarly ingenuity and reflection. I will let my valued friend from the north do the honors. I have no idea what they're talking about. Hello? Jack, if you may. Look at all these toys. Did I make these? <laughs> that statue. All right, we got a donkey one, device. Let me draw your attention. Dude, a vault, statue of a lady. Small container, a candle. To that wondrous donkey next to the entrance. Although the most astounding thing of all stands right no, it's too heavy. Why am I picking these up? That statuette. Haha, <laughs> precisely. But one thing at a time. Let us let Jack decide what to demonstrate first. Shit. Oh no. Oh no. Put it back. Look, I found a candle. Wait, it might the rest of us know how I burned down a cathedral. Uh no, it's too heavy. Wait, can I likes to take his time, doesn't he? Sick. Alright. Out for a water bowl. Here you go. What am I building? Oh, and oh, oh, now, oh, 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 Jack will heat the yes, 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 yes. Look at me doing science. It's yes. So beautiful. It will make you cry. Just listen. Did I make a music box? Oh, the bird. Yes. I made a thing. The Banu Musa brothers were three scholars of Persian descent who lived in Baghdad in the 9th century. They are known for the Book of Ingenious Devices, a large illustrated collection of mechanical appliances and automata. Those automata were largely designed for entertainment but featured innovative engineering. The brothers also wrote books on astronomy, astrology, and geometry, the last of which had a great influence on both Islamic and European mathematicians. Nice. How marvelous! I did a thing! How does it work? Maybe it's a miracle. I made a steam thing. Right. 
Go on, Jack. Tell them. Sick. It's possessed by an evil spirit. Explain it. There's a hidden wheel inside the box. It turns an axle that in return raises and drops a sequence of small cylinders inside. These cylinders work like fingers playing a flute. But who is blowing into the flute? Steam. Steam? Don't know him. Yes. When I opened the pipe, it gradually pushed itself into the tube. The power of steam. For once, Sick. I must agree. This is brilliant. Of course. It was created by a Muslim after all. <laughs> Let's you actually know about them, Lonnie. That's awesome. What else have you got, Rashid? Anyone care for some tea? Thank I want some tea. Daughter. We will have some as soon as Jack has finished our presentation. Mind if I watch? Of course sure. not. So, who is this man, Rashid? Donkey Jack device. Is a friend of the house. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can I grab these things again? A scholar and a talented artist. Uh. Just the other day, he explained Euclid to me. What is that? I need the. I need the candle. A Greek who wrote a book called The Elements of Geometry. No, it's too. Oops. I need the um the candle again. The Egyptians translated it into Arabic, and now the Englishmen are turning it into Latin. I could watch this man scoop up water all day. <laughs> watch me scoop up water all day. It's funny. Okay. No, it's for the presentation. Uh, okay. Maybe I don't need the candle. There you go. Now, watch the head. Just any moment now. There. Did you see? He vomited out a rock. It threw up. <laughs> see? Rashid, this is disgusting. Cookie <laughs> time. Oh, fuck. Cookie time, what's up, Yuri? Would you kindly explain how to cookie hiccup? Yum yum. Uh explain it. Cookie for Ted Through it, the bowl is slowly. And it's there, um, everyone popping in. Once it's full, it sinks, pulling a string which makes the ball drop onto a weight. This, in return, pulls the bowl up again, emptying it in the process. Thus setting the entire mechanism if you timed it perfectly you could make it drop a ball at every hour turning it into a clock oh that's kind of cool For me, it's oh you googled that <laughs> donkey <laughs> show us more Rashid. one could join those two and build a singing donkey oh play some stardew with sarah happy Let's birthday sarah every hour it'd be pretty clever that would be pretty clever. I know, right? You could be the one to build it. Oh, that would be unfair. It's your invention. I would let you have it. Or we design it together. Is she coming on to me? You still haven't shown us that statuette yet. We're getting to it, bruh. Of course. Jack, if you may. Whoosh. Just watch. I need to put it in, it's somewhere cold. Is this cold? I guess it's cold right there. And now? Just be patient, but don't look away. It How is that? It takes some time for her to... To do what? Mm -hmm. Is it crying? Isn't that amazing? It just condenses. No, it's irritating. 
Rashid, what is going on? We don't know. We have no idea how it works. Rashid, please. We all know that there is no such thing as a man-made miracle. And this piece of wood is very clearly made by man. I very much agree, my friends. But so far, none of us has an explanation. Any of you guys have an idea why that would work that way? All we know for certain is that her glassy eyes shed tears when you move her from warmth into cold. Like a plant at sunrise? Yeah, I was gonna say it's like some sort of like dew. Collect yeah, collection of dew, but how do they do it for a statue? The only difference is the surface. That's all. Go on. I think you may be on to something. Am I? But of course, I had no intention of disturbing your conversation. No, no, keep talking. But if you can find out why there's dew gathering on a plant, you may understand why that woman is so weepy. <laughs> so, who wants a cup of tea? Me. I'll have some. Feed me some tea, please. Your daughter is quite something, Rashid. A scholar yeah, in her talk own nerdy house. to me. I know. I'd rather she wasn't. Shut up, you. It would make marrying her off so much easier. Hell no, dude. She just oh, got I super points from me. Stay a problem for long. Maybe the dew originates from invisible water in the air. Water that stays hidden when it's hot. Shit. He's gonna like someone else now. The pilgrim trails across France converged at Osterbat in the foothills of the Pyrenees. There, the group of 20 or so pilgrims who had been traveling alongside me since I'd left Tours swelled to about 70. Some were prosperous citizens, some probably on the run from justice. <laughs> a few drunks and several monks and clergymen. Several languages were spoken, including Flemish, a German tongue, and a southern French language called Oc. Oh, I thought they said orc. <laughs> there was no lack of communication among them. And as we crossed the Pyrenees, they sang, played games, told stories, and in several cases, had love affairs. Bow, bow. While my baby and I kept mostly to ourselves. Hi, friends. Thanks for the fire. Ganz schön frech, die mit ihrem Kind. Hey, Moira, translate. Hey, <laughs> no kidding. Did you actually translate it? Rude, sir. <laughs> what did he say? The only word I uh, recognized was the. Go for a walk. Apologies to the pilgrims. Rock the baby. Bahama song. Richtig dreist. She's fairly fresh, the woman with the baby. Yeah, look at Mortimer being a boss and translating all this crap. <laughs> You're awesome. That's amazing. Can a man just have his rest? Oh, fuck that guy. Kick him in the dick. Something about knights. Something about good. Her voice is good. His wife told him off. Yeah, I think. Did she say like her uh, her voice is good or her company is good? That's enough now. At her husband. Hell yeah. Because she's like, fuck you, dude. Having a baby's hard. Keep rocking him. All right, we might have to go for a walk. I'm gonna go for a walk. Fuck you! Now that I know you're a dick, I won't apologize. I have a baby, and you're a piece of shit. Uh, I don't. <sighs> this is probably a bad idea. Oh, am I just walking around the camp until he chills out? Is that Hamley? You better not be chasing me. Bridge. 
Blind woman, hey. You need help? Dear Lord, what are you doing? You should get out of the water. It's I'm looking crazy. for my eyes. My eyes. My ring. You guys, I lost my ring. Anyone? No one's going to know that reference. That's from Blo Blo Bloodborne. I can't help you find it with a baby in my arms. Uh, search for ring. Who are these creepy guys up here? I don't. I don't like them. Just hanging out there. Come back to me, please. Come back to me. I'm trying to find it. I really don't want to go in the water. Tomorrow. Where are you? Where did you go? Oh, oh, oh! Found it! It's shining right there! Yes! I found your ring! Here you go! I found it. <gasps> I'm a good person! Here you go. Just dropped it in the water right in front of her. Yes. Oh, thank you. How do you know it's thank you your so ring? Much. You are a very kind woman. So very, very kind. No I'm problem. You can get I out of the water now. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so Wait, much. Wait, she's Gollum. Shit. Just gave Gollum my ring. Mama's just snoring up a storm here. Tell me about your ring. Yeah, are you getting warmer? Are you getting warmer? I am, thank you. I can see this ring is very precious to you. It, it was a gift from my stepmother. She thought <gasps> I would Community challenge 95% complete. Holy crap! We're gonna be playing some more blood or bloodboard board grain stream. Heck yeah, dudes. Why did you leave? You guys are legendary. Oh, I, I... I thought I didn't belong. She always said I was her daughter, but I was sure she was lying. I was so selfish and so stupid. Too stupid to see I really was happy. Tell me about your stepmother. She was such a kind woman. So very, very kind. I don't want to say that, but it's making me. Maybe you really weren't happy. I don't know. I was very young and thought I was unhappy because I didn't live close to the sea. But in the end, the sea did not feel the same about me. The cold there made me sick. It took away my oh, sight. Oh shit. It did take courage for you to leave. It was courageous of you to leave. You did what your heart told you to. I was stupid. So, so stupid. Ah, that's why it's so, you so went stupid. on a pilgrimage. Uh, comma. Yes. So that St. James might see my devotion. And I will be united with my mother in heaven. I'm just not as kind as you. Not kind at all. Uh, we have much in common because I left. Actually, we two have quite a few things in common. I too am trying to make amends with the one man I love the most. Yeah, yeah, I heard that grunt. I, was told he went I heard that to grunt. <laughs> You will know soon. Not soon enough. It's still four weeks till I get there. He'll be there, I'm sure of it. I hope so. I just feel... I just feel that with every day that passes, I'm losing him a bit more. And that the only thing I can allow myself still to hope for is not love, but forgiveness. I understand. 
Hey, hush now. Not long now and our journey will be over. Hmm? It started it started as multiplayer, right? Uh that's a seashell. El Camino de Santiago, also known as the Way of St. James, is a Christian pilgrimage route to the Cathedral of Santiago de Compostela. The Saint of Compost. Where the remains of Jesus' Apostle St. James the Greater were presumably put to rest, the pilgrimage of Santiago besides Jerusalem and Rome is one of the most important pilgrimages in Christianity and is believed to be one of the only ways to free a pilgrim of their sins. By the 12th century, it has become a well-organized undertaking. Even a book was written as a travel guide for pilgrims. The Codex Calixtinus, Calixtinus? Supporting the pilgrims is completing... Supporting the pilgrims in completing their travel. The scallop shell is used to guide the pilgrims on their way and serves as a symbol of St. James and the Camino because of the end of their travel. The pilgrims almost have reached the ocean. Can you... Hold on. I'm going to talk just enough so the mic can pick it up. You might hear Mama's in the background. And that would be her snoring. Can you hear the moments? Hold on a minute. Wait for it. There it is. Do you hear it? Nope, that one was quiet. Jada, stop licking the toes. That's how you get out. We stab it. No. But she, she definitely do be foghorning. You've only ever played a co-op. I picked up Stargu a long time ago to check it out. And I think I played it for like eight or ten hours straight, and then I never played it again. And I didn't do anything with the rest of the villagers. I ignored every party they did. I didn't care about anything. I just planted my stuff. I was not good at that game because I was just like, no, nah, I need I'm 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 farming and I'm going in the cave and breaking a bunch of rocks. Yeah, see, Moira, that's, uh, I would have been one of your friends doing serious farming things. <laughs> You're seducing a redhead. <laughs> Much better than Abby. Is Abby a character in, um, Stardew? The woman's name was Alba. She came from a small town somewhere in Catalonia. I quickly got used to her constantly feeling out for her stepmother's ring and the sad guilt that would always follow in her milky eyes. What are you talking about? I found the ring. I wasn't sure if she appreciated my company, but I couldn't leave her on her own either. By the time we reached Los Arcos, she'd stopped talking, while I kept on dropping a kind word here and there to let her know I was still by her side. Mm -hmm. I'm going this way. Alba believed herself to be of weak mind and body. Purple hair eats rocks. And she, walked the she eats rocks. A strong sense of purpose. Useless as a spouse. <laughs> it made me wonder about what I. She actually eats rocks. Is she a monster in the game? Did I hope for love, or was I really traveling because I needed him to forgive me? But what was there to forgive? My decision to marry Alfred had been in the best interest of the people of Shiring. It was a sacrifice I had to make to stop the evil reign of William Hamley. Mm -hmm. These questions had haunted me for a long time I hope that Jack would understand. Now. But if I really was going to see Jack soon, it was time to make up my mind. On to Leon. Once de Leon in the Fountain of Youth. Around Leon, the path began to gradually turn uphill. It was only two more weeks till we'd reached Santiago. The baby was in a good mood, and so surprisingly was out. Can you imagine walking for four weeks straight? After Astorga, the trail got more difficult. Alba became slower and slower, and we had to rest more. No. Oh. She became quiet again. Can we just drop her off somewhere where she can be safe? Her body grew, and she worried that she might not be able to reach. She's not a monster, just a weirdo. Does she have pika? Is that why she eats rocks? Onward. The next morning, she refused to get up. No. Her. her breathing was disturbingly shallow, and she hardly noticed me touching her forehead. Oh, my Everything friend. Hurts, she said, and urged me to continue with On Ferrata.
Hauling a baby? Yeah, four, that's even worse. Walking on foot for four weeks while hauling a baby. Oof. We're staying with her. Of course, I stayed with her. I brought her food and water and sat by her side. But day after day, her condition grew worse. Look, there's an extra space she again. She kept on urging me to go, to find Jack, saying the monks of Ponferrada would take care of her. And I'm going to go find the monks. Fuck. I'd I mean... hardly known her. And most of the time, she would tried to push me away, as if she considered herself a nuisance that slowed me down. Oh, I'm crying. I deserve company. It wasn't until a few moments before she died. No! For the first time, she smiled at me. And I like to believe that she saw me smile back. Oh. I still like to believe my friend in this unlikely place, dying next to a near stranger. She'd found a moment of yeah. serenity and happiness. Yep. But she'd not reached Santiago. When I left, that thought still haunted me. To see that a journey could come to an end so suddenly. But what would be different if she had reached Santiago? Could she have been disappointed by what she found? Man. That's sad. Holy crap, mamas. After months of Please, for the love of God, don't have left. Finally reached Santiago de Compostela. In the evening, we attended mass in the great cathedral, then started to roam the town looking for my dear Jack. It was almost dawn when finally a priest pointed me to an inn close by. Oh. Oh. A doggo! I want to pet the doggo. Let me pet doggo. Oh. Hello, innkeeper. Fireplace, jars. Check out the fireplace real quick. Yeah, I mean, she said that she would have named him already, but she didn't want to name him until she saw Jack. But yeah, <laughs> don't grow attached to it. Don't name him until we know that their chance of survivability goes up. Buenos dias. Do you understand me? Bro, what's up, my dude? Welcome to the stream. Um, I can't, no, I don't need I can't understand that if that just stay there. I was told a friend of mine stayed here some time ago. A red-haired Englishman called Jack. Do you remember him? Nope. English? Nope. No Francais or English. But how you doing, you bra? It's been a hot minute. I mean, I've seen you in other streams. But it's good to see your face in the zit chat. How you doing, my friend? Uh... Maybe. Oh, I'm starting to forget the details of his face. That's why it's getting all scratched out. You guys can't see it. Hold on. Right here. Oh, wait. I'm picking it up. There. You can see it. Can I... Have you seen a man called Jack Builder? Jack? He's a mason. Jack? Yes. Have you seen him? Pasanche por aquí centos de peregrinos, e cada un eche de seu pai. Vas ter que ser algo máis específica. I don't understand. Isn't mice... Um... Corn? Oh, no, no, that's mice. Find out where Jack was here. Can I go to the cathedral? Oh! Oh, that activates everything. Hey, dude. I already tried that. No. I, Where are you? I Jack? did the pilgrim. I didn't talk to him. I must find him. Uh huh. 
Uh. I can't go into the inn? Wait a minute. I can Where jack jars? You, okay. Jack. Mice is more? That doesn't sound right. No, mice is, uh, moss is more. Not mice. I'm doing just fine, you bruh. I'm just holding things together. It, uh, yeah, it's a point and click, uh, it's more of an adventure point and click interactive novel than a game, but we're having fun. Yeah, Moira actually translated some of the German people were spitting out. It was great. All right. Where do I fucking go? I was told that Jack stayed here, but how can I make myself understood? Uh, I don't I have no idea what to do. I've got nothing here. It, it can't be like a lot the book. If this is it, I'm gonna lose my mind. Hey, have you seen this book being used somewhere? for a man who likes to read a lot. El ojo anda siempre con libro en riva. Have you seen anyone like that? Pero, ¿por qué levas un libro en riva? Vas descangallar con peso. Hmm, she doesn't even understand that I'm looking for a person yet. You're actually from Germany, you bro? Holy crap. I have a baby, let me stay here. Yeah, he's got red hair. Or he's a redhead, right? Can you give us food? Have you seen his father? I haven't given him a name yet. She's not going to understand any of this. Have you seen his father? Padre del Nino? I know that. Jack father of the kid. Ben sendo un peregrino? What? E un peregrino? Oh, no. No. He's not a pilgrim. Oh. He's a mason. Oh, can I point out the jars? He's a mason. Oh, y mal rayo me partas entendo que me estás a contar. Normally I can glean stuff from Spanish words by looking at it. No fucking idea what's getting in this. Is there a guest who can translate? Oh, is there someone inside who might be able to translate for us? Nena que te merke que te entenda. A translator? A, a guest? Agora mesmo estanche todos a dormir. Case che diria que volvas maña por la maña. Ah! Um... Let me show you something. Uh, point at in. Ask for help. Fireplace. Point at jars. Cathedral. He's a mason. He builds things like that. Ah, ah so she got it. Albanil. See. Si. See, a mason. It's the same word in Galician. <laughs> Por aquí pasan una morea de masons. No me poderías decir algo más sobre él. Um, oím falar de un masón que dice que se dedica a traducir libros en Toledo. Por lo visto, he worked in Toledo. Yes, Jack. Have you seen him? No sé qué es el apellido, pero. Red-haired Mason. Ah. Uh, yeah, I don't understand you exactly. I don't understand you. He's in Toledo. So I will go to Toledo then. Gracias. Thank you. I just 
pray that I understood you correctly. Holy shit, dude. All right, let me catch up on chat. We lost internet. Uh oh. Look like sound like Catalan or a weird version of Portuguese. Portuguese. Ice tear case, ser mais especifica, if you got to be more specific. Oh, was that a form of Portuguese? Well, yeah, well, there's Portugal down there. That could explain why I don't understand it. If this is historical, I think it's somewhat historical, but I'm not sure. I know it's based on a couple of books. I don't know if it's fiction, though. You live in the southeast of Germany. That was the state I mentioned. Oh, that's awesome. I've always wanted to visit Germany. You have family in Munchen. Munchen is something. No idea <laughs> what that is. Holy crap. We got so many people from Germany here. This is amazing. Oh, it's Galician. Oh, okay. 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 Munich. Got it. We're going to this place. We got this epic music like we're doing something. Wait a minute. I passed it. Wait, why did I walk past it? Am she? They're talking to me, chat. You know I speak sheep. Buenos dias. Hello. Parlez-vous français? You speak English? French? Of course. Oh, How sick. may I help you? I was told a man named Jack Builder lives in this house. Who told you this? A group of scholars living at the edge of town. They said he used to translate old scriptures about mathematics before he moved here. Please wait here. I will talk with Master Rashid. Oh, it's that dude. Oh, oh, we found it, I think. Dude, this place is stinking pretty. Look at this. Wait, dip the baby in the fountain. It'll let me do it. Uh, I'm not going to dip the baby in the fountain. What will he think of me now? Not yet, anyway. I'm going to dip the baby in the fountain. You'd like that, wouldn't you? <laughs> I'm sorry, game. <laughs> it's like... Uh, so there, there's... There, I want to look this up. If there's a, an anomaly... Anomaly is not the right word. Uh... I can't think of the word, but you guys might understand, but there's a there's a thing where like in a video game, if something sounds like sick or twisted and you're like, will the game let me do this? I have to try and you have to try it. It's like, so if anyone grew up with Nintendo 64 and Super Mario 64, when the first time you picked up one of those baby penguins and you're like, oh, baby penguin edge. And then everyone had the same thoughts like, can I throw the baby a penguin off the edge? And you yeet him off the edge and then you immediately feel bad, but you had to try it. That was that right there. Just can I dunk the baby in the fountain? I had to try. Knock, knock. I'm looking for Jack. What will he think of me now? On the house that Jack built. Anyone know that nursery rhyme? Don't throw peng penguin babies off ledges. I have not met lizard. I've not met a single person that has not thrown that baby penguin off a ledge. Take a peek. All right. What's this going to do? Yeah. And it's like, that's not my baby. I don't care about it. It's fucking. Oh, we were here. I'm going to get in trouble for being here. There's no door. I'm invited. <gasps> Slingshot. Oh, it's his. Yes. Oh, God. Chat, we made it. Oh, shit. Hi. Oh, shit. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, she got judge eyes. She got the judgy eyes. Hey, look, you see the orange hair? Uh, you're oh, gonna be mad. There you are. Hello. Uh, may I ask who let you stroll around our house? Aisha. I know someone named Aisha. I'm looking for someone. I was asked to wait here. Uh, I was asked to wait here. 
Yes, my servant told me already. My father's not here at the moment, so you'll have to make do with me. Okay. She's not going to tell me. Unfortunately, I must disappoint you. <gasps> Lies! No Uncle Jack living in this house. Lies. Well, actually, she's telling the truth. I found his slingshot. Please let me talk to him. Please let me talk to him. He may not live here, but you know where he's at. <sighs> I'm sorry, but this is not easy for any of us. What do you mean? I think you should know that Jack and I. Ah, are each other. shit, dude! Maybe we should go inside. The sun's burning, and my mother doesn't need to hear us. I don't like this. Jack told me about you. You are Aliena. Uh huh. You're the one who rejected him and married his stepbrother. I did it for good. Of people. And now you want him back. Shut up. You don't understand. I need my son to meet his father. I need my son to meet his father. His father? Can you not tell? The other one is Jack's son. You can't tell? He is. Look at this orange bonnet of goofy he hair. He said that he had come here to find out about his family. But instead, he found out about everything else. About philosophy, mathematics. When he and my father met, it was love at first sight. It was a rule you had to eat the baby? Yes, yeah, see? together and made great plans. But in the end, Jack would always start talking about his cathedral. Where in the world is baby daddy? <laughs> church he would build one day. Rib vaults and pointed windows. Why am I carrying that baby? That's my baby. He'd ramble on about it for hours and stare up at that ceiling. We three sat here for hours and talked. And then in the evenings... I don't know. Maybe we all three can, you know, have our own little so many family dynamic. That sounds fine. Future. Some barely more than silly dreams. Others almost in arm's reach. Are you up out and change mind. He always had his head in the clouds. You're talking about a man as if he were just gone. Oh. Yeah. Did he leave? You're talking about him as if he were gone. If he fucking left... Well, He's not here. Uh, My father had offered him work as a master builder here in Toledo. He would have been well off. Hell yeah, master builder, though. To spend his evenings under vaults like this. With me as his wife. But in the end, he refused. Hmm. Oh. Tell me, did you really marry his son? Oh, uh, so did you lie to me? You lied to me. I had to. It was the hardest decision I ever made. But it also felt like a sacrifice I had to make to fulfill a promise I made to my father. You like a sage great, right? I like her hair too. I thought I had no choice. I didn't want to hurt him. Believe me. Please be a kind I person. Do. Please be a kind you person. Know, He left me because of you. Oh, shit, dog. Oh, oh, oh that's a fucking adorable. Because <sighs> uh, he knows. Be glad that you ran into me and not my mother. She was enraged. When oh, she's left. a good person. Huh. He can have oh. a on people. Chat, but when I say that, we made our peace with him. The sigh of relief I just had was um, as a parting gift. and like head rushy. A small wooden statue with stone eyes in exchange for his slingshot. Would you mind telling me where he Which went? I totally didn't just steal. He went to Paris. Fuck, I was just there. Oh, Wait, was I not? Of oh god. He said I'm going to die on my way over there. Father, so there was no reason to stay down here. <laughs> I'm invested. I don't even care about their heads. <laughs> Yes. Moira, I fucking yes, love you. Him, <sighs> Tell him I don't. Uh, thank you and all the best. I'm sorry for all this. Yes, thank you. I, I wanted to say thank both of those. Let me say both of them, bro. The best to your family. Thank you. Fucking. Uh, what is the child's name, by the way? I haven't named him yet. Well, he has none yet. I wouldn't name him. Maybe I should Jack. put his slingshot back. Isn't that a bit silly? <laughs> 
Maybe. But he's his son as well as mine. It's his right to have a say in it too. Then off to Paris. That baby needs a name. Oh, she's a good person. We will get one. Thank you. Oh, she's a good person. Ugh. Oh. Like, I don't know about you guys, but, like, especially shows nowadays, like, there, there was a show before, like, Game of Thrones. I don't remember what it was, but, like, it was the taste of, like, people just being dicks for the sake I of being dicks and the for the sake of drama and shows. And that seems Stormbird to have taken off. And, and that's, like, in every of show. Course, and I fucking hate it. And it's, like, and no one is a good it. person. It is it such a sigh of relief to experience to Paris, a decent person. For once, which is a really weird thing to say, but that's how shows and stuff are now. It's like, no, do it for the drama. It doesn't fucking make sense. They actually screwed themselves over just for the sake of your drama. Fuck you and your bad writing. I don't know. I'm just, I'm ranting now. Have a good one, you bro. I hope you sleep well, my friend. I hope to see you some more as well. It's a side braid. <laughs> If Jack really was there, can't be a bad person with a side braid. To to him? I will pull him very close. I was sure I would slap him. We'd have to sit down and talk. We had to hear each other out before we could walk on again in whatever direction oh, that would boy. be. My God, that's a lot of walking. Holy fuck, dude. We're going to be ancient by the time we find him. Perry. Epic music. Let me find him. Go get your man. <laughs> Silica. Our son, Denis. I guess it's Denny. No sound. It's gonna have like a slow pan when he reveals. I'm calling it. All right, you motherfuckers, tell me where my cousin, uh, son's dad's at. Oh God. Does he have a beard? What do you guys think? Do you think he has a beard? It's you, 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 it's you. Cry, baby, cry. Fuck. Smack him. Fucking, fucking, fucking. He's right here, bruh. He right there. Ah! Ah! We saw his face. Bruh. Colorful light from the windows. Turn around, you heard the baby. There, there. Ah, oh. Are we Make noise! Then? You almost missed this. How do you not see it? Bruh! Look ah! at these colorful windows. Look at the light. Fucking something! Let me talk to him. Let me click. Give me my mouse. Ah! <laughs> Don't you run! Don't you run! Ah! We're doing it! to see you, Jack. Hi, Dad! Uh, we? It's Baby! Is... is he... <laughs> Look what we made! He is your son. We made this! My... my son? I'm sorry. It's not your fault. Oh, he's a good person! I love Ali, good people. Where do we go from here? Wherever we go. Oh, we'll go <laughs> thank God, thank God. <sighs> will, will you marry me? Yes, fucking yes. Oh, Welcome God. <laughs> Can't marry a kid. That's weird. We will. Uh. We stayed in Paris as husband and wife. Oh, I'm ready for a nap. That's too much endorphins. The day Tommy. We named him. His name is Jack Tommy. Learned much working as a builder in Saint Denis. Oh, 
days became months. Who's ready for a nap? Then after a year, we both <laughs> Sorry, <restless>. Joe, I'm cry. <laughs> Where can we go from oh. here? We asked ourselves again. They named the baby Tommy. We both confessed that we wanted to see our families, our friends. Oh. And then we knew where we wanted to go. Too much home serotonin. I need a nap. Even if it was in shambles. Oh. Next not popping. We need to hurry. The ship to England will leave soon. If we die We're on the ship back, I'm gonna there. fucking lose my mind. If the crowd doesn't clear up, we'll miss our ship. Get out the way, fools. Ooh. Our carriage. Uh-oh, what's going on? Could make the horse get their attention. Or ride it through the crowd. That sounds a bit dangerous, doesn't it? Uh oh. Mm -hmm. You think? Uh oh. There's a monk. Oh, what did I just pick up? The inside of the box kept her warm and the wood slightly damp. Why? Why am I okay? That's really what I'm carrying in that chest. Oh shit. Do you know what's going on? Oh, chaos. I can't get these people to calm down. God knows I tried. What happened? The jongleur told the crowd a few stories. Then he sold people some miracle charms, but it was just fairy tales and painted stones. Well, it always is. Snake oil salesman. No, but I'd need a real miracle to calm them down now. Otherwise, they'll rip him apart. Hello, Ben. Crimson! How's it going, friend? Welcome to the stream. I honestly don't care about getting involved here. I really don't. Uh, excuse me. Can I get What's to the ship, please? Here? He's a thief. He told us lies and stole our money. But isn't that just a simple jongleur? That poor man. We need to help him. Do we? Why? Oh, he doesn't like it. Uh, neither do I. Oh my god, one of the dogs farted. Woo! Holy crap, that is... That is spicy. Can I just fucking leave, bro? Oh, shady spot. Hey, look. Oh god. Is this? Hey, look. Oh shit. Do you see? It's working. Your friend Rashid must be. Quite oh good. boy. I'm gonna get us in trouble. I don't want to be involved in this. Look at the swarming in her eyes. That's great. I don't want to get involved in this. They're gonna come after me. I don't want to get involved in this. Because then they'll think I work with him. Sorry, I'm not getting involved with this. <laughs> no dogs. No dog part. Have you tried calming them down? I did. But a single priest just wasn't enough. Here you go. You want this? You can do it. It looks like she's crying. Good lord. How does that work? It's a miracle. Can we just get out of here, please? It's not going to let me leave. I have to do this. I'm going to get myself killed. Look. What's going on? The Holy Mother. She's crying. Out of the way. Touch not the Holy Mother. <laughs> it is a sin to desecrate the image of the Virgin. It's true. Lord in heaven. Why is she crying? <laughs> she is not amused. Because we need to take the ship. I want to say that. I don't want to get involved, dude. That is awesome, Crimson. I'm glad uh, you're getting some extra time. 
I really don't want to... This guy swindled people out of their fucking money and livelihood, so fuck that guy. But... At the same time, if we say... If we use the, the Holy Mother as a way for obvious selfish reasons, then they could get mad at us too. What do you guys think? Should we just say because we need to take the ship or because of your actions? Either way, it could have negative consequences. I don't like any of these choices. Can't, we should have just used the horse and be like, get out the way, fool. I need to go on this ship. Fuck, because of your actions. She weeps for your sins. That is... What is this man? Done that is much bigger than it was before. Before I just like grab it with my one hand and grab the whole thing. Now it's like, all right, maybe that thing is super special. It's gotten the size of my whole upper torso. The word of God. It is the mother of God. Forgive us, Holy Mother. Now leave. She come from? Cookie time. Cookie time. Where did she come from? Tell the truth. Okay. She was given to me by a scholar in hey, Tereda. Hey, go. Hey, go. She cries because... Jack, yeah, don't. Should. I shouldn't be telling it's the truth. It's a miracle. Yeah, just let him think that. Miracle. Sure. A miracle. Go with that. Yes. <gasps> he was totally going to go full science on him. <laughs> the Holy Virgin has chosen this young family to protect her. Tell us all where you are headed. Get out the way. Her destination is beyond these waters. In the small I like how he's trying. <laughs> Kingsbridge, in the earldom of Shiring. There she wants to rest. Kingsbridge? Where's that? Hail Mary! Make way for the Holy Virgin! Hallelujah! Make Robert well! Goodbye. Huh? Blessed Mary, let my daughter conceive. Give us a good They're heart. throwing money at us, chat. They're donating to ask for her blessing. Shit, no. Uh, I don't. They the j literally Madonna just got mad. Hear your prayer. And at swindling. With your no, 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 no. I shall build her a new shrine at Kingsbridge, a cathedral. <gasps> it's. It's you. Uh oh. Who are you? Uh, who do you mean? You. The red haired ghost. What? Me? A ghost? Uh oh. Uh, my husband is very much alive. Uh. I've known him since he was 12 years old. Uh. He drowned. By God, you drowned. Uh. 24 years ago. On the white ship. <gasps> my poor, poor son. My Jacques. His name was Jacques. Jacques Cherbourg. Jacques Cherbourg. Holy shit! It's my dad's mom. That came from nowhere. Holy shit, dude. Okay. My god. Your dog heard cookie time in a man's voice and was very confused. <laughs> Lonnie, I get that too. And watching streamers and stuff and they say treats or something. Both the dogs like, no! And then I have to go get him treats. <laughs> yeah, we met, uh, we met Granny. You felt hopeful on the ship from England to Normandy. You followed the coachwoman's advice and ran into the dead end. And Barfleur. You and your baby fell seriously ill, but you both managed to survive. Could we have both died? One or both of us died there? Oh, God, that just gave me a shiver. You helped another pilgrim along the way of St. James. You snuck into Rashi's sacred archive. I did. You stole Jack's slingshot. I did that. You found Jack in Paris. You decided to go back to Kingsbridge. Can you not find Jack? Oh, my God. You decided to go back. You saved a jungler from a lynch mob. I, that was unintentional, but sure. You met Jack's grandmother and finally learned about the fate of his father. Neat. He's too round the treats for him. <laughs> Jab to 16. He you, dog. Search, search to add. 
What's that, Josh? Oh, I'm the monk again. Look at these flowers. So much has grown, but there are no roots, no herbs. He's gonna be a little bit taller. Yep. Oh, they shaved his head. <laughs> what hey, buddy. At, Jonathan? The garden is in disorder. How do you not get a sunburn? I want it to be right again, but I don't know how to. Your do stream it. title. Search, search. <laughs> Wait, is that what my stream title says? Oh, you're right. What the fuck? How'd that happen? Neat. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Well, what did you do? I cleaned up. Where do we start? Hmm. I'll loosen the soil. So just to pluck weeds. Yes. Hmm. Some plants are weeds and must go before we can plant new seeds. What are weeds? They take away. You roll them in paper. Need to grow. And smoke them. Light, water, room. What do we do? But only a certain day on the calendar. They look a lot like every other plant. Oh, I don't fucking know. I need to go to bed. My brain is doing things. See those? They're called wood sorrel. Don't smoke that. Let's pluck only those for now. I'll do it. If you insist. Make sure Hell yeah, slave labor for the children. Months. We don't have to do the garden work. We just make them do it. And now what do I do? Ask him, uh... Sure. For plants to take root, the soil must be loose and fertile. So Wait, can you eat? May I dig now? Can you eat that stuff? The sorrel? He, you dogs. Done. This kid's a pro gardener. What's next? I need him for my actual house. Clearing the whole area. I didn't plant it yet. Lies. A Bloodborne board game thing gonna pop real soon. Nice. Stay here. I'll be right back. 49k. Bringing him some seats. I miss all my friends that were in here. Garlic. Let's plant some garlic, yo. Or those are onions. Also, I ate a clove of garlic the other day, now, just like, because my, my teeth that? have been hurting. And so I just was like, fuck it. And I just popped off a big fresh clove of garlic and chomped on it. Holy fuck. After chewing up for like a minute, my mouth was on fire. But it helped. Young sorrel is good. Mature sorrel can be toxic. Oh, see, I didn't know that. You always said you wanted to plant these seeds and make a new garden, Milius. I think it's about it gets time. tough when it gets older. What seeds were these? Did did we figure that out? Or are those the seeds I found forever ago? Oh, it's my friend. What happened to them? Did they just die? I remember what Cuthbert died because he just got old. Do you remember Millie? I don't know how Millie's died. With a warm smile. Well, he told me to give you this. What happened to Milius? He suppose wow. he could have died just from age during the time pass. This place is still covered in grasses and vines and stuff. 
So we can have a hell of a time to grow. Just have to wait. All right. <laughs> Longer than that, kid. He's like, come on. Why isn't it growing? How long do we have to wait? Um, how long? Too long for us to keep sitting here. This kid. Uh, that long. Some things take time. And only with patience. Why do they go bald in the same spot? <laughs> Why do we have to do all these things if all we had to do is wait? Simply waiting would not have been enough, Jonathan. You just paved the way for things to take their course. They are happening right now. I want to know where that came from. Time, we will return and like, who had the, the idea to shave the top of your head? Of something new. Oh. As a symbol of piety, oh. like, where did you get that? God's reward. Maybe. You know what Have I mean? Made things grow. You made it. The hearth yeah. has some real house moving castle just vibes. The seed. It's it's stinking pretty. Love Hell's Moving Castle. It's a great movie. Better water it. Also, did you guys know the reason because or how having a moving, moving castle? It's because he's petty and he just wanted to dodge taxes. <laughs> I fucking love it. Oh, funny dude. I bet that water's better. This practice of cutting or shaving That's some of all the hair walk. on the scalp is a sign of religious devotion or humility. This right. So I know that it's a sign for that, right. but who came up with it and why? Who was like, you know what? As a sign for my devotion, I'm going to shave a circle on the top of my head. Bucket. Like, I want to know where the reasoning came from. Was it a symbol like of old guys going bald? So they said, all right, well, six year old shave their head. I fucking don't know. It's just weird. What's gotten into Philip? Ooh, pretty. That looks like a shot from Breath of the Wild. Our church Originated with the disciple of Jesus who observed the Torah command not to shave their hair around the sides of one's head. Dire times have revealed Wait, what? something important to us. Originated with disciples of Jesus who observed the Torah command to not shave their hair. What do you mean? Well, that makes sense. It's like, don't shave the hair around the sides of your head. But why shave the hair where your yarmulke would go? Also, the yarmulke is right here anyway. And Jews don't believe that Jesus was the savior. And these monks shave like the whole top. It's very confusing. Hey, Suplex, what's up, my dude? You did a thing! <laughs> Thanks so much. Hey, we have now going to be playing the Bloodboard board game at some point in the future. So, uh... Maybe, um... I don't know. Maybe... Because I, I think we can... Obviously, we can play the board game now. Um, at any point. But what do you guys think? Should we paint some figures before we play? Or should we just try to play it? I... Actually, you know what? I would vote that we just try to play it on a weekend just because I don't know how long it's going to take for some of those paints I, I ordered to come in. It can take like 15 days for it to even show up um, or even get shipped. So uh, maybe like this weekend we can play. What's up, Soups? How you doing, my dude? It's good to see you. I was lurking in you and uh, Amdusha's stream today when you guys were drawing Pokemans. You googled deeper, and apparently slaves had their heads shaved to show they didn't have any rights. So they were respecting the rules that not to shave the head, but show they are slaves of Christ. Okay. That's interesting. I got it. Also, we got a crap ton of uh, streamers in chat right now. Let me give some shout outs here. Everyone should go follow everyone, because they're awesome. We love everyone here. Uh, I did C. <laughs> it's fine. Suplex is hilarious. Definitely go check him out. 
Um, I just mentioned Amdusha. She does amazing art. And she's getting into tattooing. She just tattooed herself. And it's she's freaking incredible. She did the life drawing. Or the lifelike drawing of the... Well, I'm pointing. and It's behind me, but you guys can't see it anymore. Because uh, it's green screen. But she did the lifelike drawing of the doggos. Or one of them. Um, definitely go check each other out. We got some wonderful people in chat here. Definitely go get each other some follows. Um, and uh, yeah, Soups and Amdusha were... They draw together sometimes, and they draw Pokemon, and it's it's great fun. But definitely, definitely go check each other out. SO is on cooldown. Heckin' cooldowns. There shouldn't be a cooldown for mods, that's weird. <laughs> Thanks, Josh. <laughs> Make sure I'm not missing any chat. Yeah, I'm good for the most part. Just, uh... Been living... Playing games? <laughs> Get shouted out. That music link's part of the land in Warcraft. Has a day-night cycle? Everything has a day-night cycle. In WoW. Don't, don't they? I could have swore they did. Claim that God doesn't watch them. Claim they don't need a church. Yeah, I didn't pay attention to what they were saying. So you don't need a church. You've been praying in these ruins. But you've been Ardenweald is a perpetual orders. nighttime. Oh. In humbleness. I would live there. I like nighttime. We don't need a church for prayer. Where else are we going to pray? The chapter house? Sure. The church is where God resides. God doesn't work in the ways we might assume. Today, Jonathan tended to our garden to make it beautiful again. And he told me of things oh soups <laughs> excuse me i can breathe <coughs> not choke on my own spit evil. I'm not did, uh, so or lost ember uh messed up your computer did you ever get they it to back up and running because oh my god that game is so good claim that man is god claim that the man is the devil ah these are both awful if i claim that man is god i'm gonna get crucified Both these options are going to cause a problem. Uh, fine man's devil. We have witnessed that man carries the devil in his heart. But even before he can... It runs, but he's just too old and bust for nicer games. Oh, that's a bummer, dude. God is born within us. As we were created... In How old's your PC? What, what CPU and stuff are you running on? Needs no special... Place, for we are his church. That dude, that In game is actions, so good. He exists. We are God's temple. No man is closer Heck and to God beautiful. than any other man. Can see that's a good GPU. We pray in church or on the streets of our towns. The 1060 is still good. What kind of CPU Whether do you got? Man, woman, monk, or bishop. I was running on a 780 you Ti. See them. You've not got too to long see ago. The horses and the colors. Jonathan. Listen to him. Now, what's going on? I I heard noises and I went to look. Calm down. What happened? But the priest said they brought a miracle. Who? I5? What? Yeah, what? I had a I5 7700. If you want, dude, I'd be happy to look at some of your settings. Like, your your setup was technically better than the one I had. Who is that? They brought us a miracle. Or sorry, when I said seventy-seven hundred, that's an i seven. Um, I had something around yours, soups. I had an i five as well. So if you want, um, you must be prior Philip. Could maybe look at some settings for you. I have been sent by the Archbishop of Canterbury. Here is his letter, in case you have reasonable doubt. Crap, and I can't remember what it was. I5. All right, I'm going to look it up. I still have the set stats somewhere. I'm going to look it up, just so I'm not, you know, saying something that is not true. Um, my PC... 
was. Do, 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 do. First processor. Oh, I, I lied. It wasn't an i5. It was an i7. It was a 4820. I lied. I apologize, my friend. I apologize greatly. I could have swore I was on an i5. I didn't have i5 in my brain. Oh, I might have i5 in my brain because a friend of mine was trying to build a new PC so she could play games. And one of her builds had i5 on it and it was like, no, don't do that. That is old. That's getting old. Are you really bad Intel Silicon Lottery? No. You don't think you're going back to Intel every game? Oh, see, I, I exclusively do Intel. I've had bad luck with AMD. You have a Ryzen 9? Nice. I think a maintenance guy kind of screwed you because he was supposed to do some work on Outlet. I told him to not work. I told him not to work yet, but he took out a fuse when the PC was on. Ooh. You think you got a, a surge? Have you run a, any sort of system di diagnostics? To check for like a bad pieces of RAM or anything? Or bad sectors, I should say. Philip of Kingsbridge, I hereby implore you to accept the grace of the weeping Madonna, for she has chosen Kingbridge as her shrine. After the rumors of a miracle had come to my ears, I had called for the procession to see me. I then saw it with my own eyes. She is real. I have claimed the miracle for England and had intended to retain her in Winchester. The guardians of the Madonna have convinced me otherwise. They have come to England only to support the rebuilding of Kingsbridge. You have my blessings, Philip of King. Philip of Kingsbridge, I expect you to restore your priority worthy of the Holy Madonna. Theobald. What happened to the Hamleys? charged to accompany the weeping Madonna. She is to replace the loss of your relic. The Saint Adolphus I'd be happy to help, Marta, man. Like, if you if you need anything, you know, just feel free to DM force. me or whatever. And what? I love your stream and I would love to see you On definitely finish travel, Lost Ember. It is an absolute away, gem. Africa. She has collected donations. It sucks when people can't play games that for your faith in her one they're they're really the digging, but two that are just like some of those this. games that need to be played. What that's what's this? her name? You do believe. Oh, that's both of us. That is why she came, and that is why you. Why are we wearing the mask for one? Is it because we know Monk today? <gasps> He's a salesman. The weeping Madonna came to me in a faraway land named Africa. A baptized Saracen was her former guardian. And I He's and fucking the lying. custodians of the Holy Virgin were chosen to take her on a journey. Why are you lying? Why is there a furry in the background? You guys see this? I knew not her powers or destination. Nevertheless, I carried her for many miles. Many bore witness to You're a monk and you're fucking lying. Before it dawned what country did you come from? On me. What country did you say you came from? We have traveled Yeah, Gree. Oh yeah, you got to do the the real ending of Gree too. Mm, too it's so good. That's another game that's fantastic. The far away land of Africa. Africa has many countries, I've heard. Yes. How do you get that? Um does. so you know every section you collect the little star or blobby thing is should be her shelter i'm trying to pay attention while reading chat at the same time this time it was the madonna herself he can ramble um you need to she find says, them all in every area you shall build me a new fortunately you can like quick travel to get him um so you need to get them all and then set off with the if I remember correctly, Archbishop after you get them all, you need to go back to the main hub, and I think you go down, and, and like a new one shows up, and you grab Paris, it, and it gives you the full ending. I think, but I do know you need to get them all. Over the sea, Fortunately, they're not difficult, all the way to but it's, it's worthwhile getting the full ending. Devout Christians have given money for the building of the given money. Of the weeping Madonna. What's it like in Africa? The sun is always shining, and miracles happen every day. His it's unblinking, or like, great he deserts, blinks, but his eyes, like, and creatures that an Englishman can't you know, he holds them open too much. He's like got creepy eyes. 
Are they horses? They are not. To you, they might resemble horses, but the name the Africans have for these creatures is impossible to pronounce, even for me. Those are fucking horses, mate. The Weeping Madonna! Those are fucking horses! Chosen you! It's a fig. You mentioned there were fig trees in Africa. What are they? He should know what it's a fig is. A, it's a fruit, of course. It looks like a strawberry and tastes like a pear. The scripture mentions these figs. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was gonna say like that. that. Why is that? No two apples look or taste alike. Uh, the same. This guy can't be a monk, right? Figs, and doubly so. I'm getting the impression that this man has never even been to Africa. But why would he lie? Because he's a piece of shit. Hmm. He's in it for the you money. You heard me correctly. Oh, it was a long get Bible journey. thumped. What is in this book will not help me. The weeping the Madonna came to me in, in a faraway heart. land named Africa. A baptized Saracen was her former guardian, and I and the custodians of the Holy Virgin were to chosen to take her on now. a journey. Baptized. Hello. Not now. Well, not I now, me. Not hey. Her powers or destination? Uh, excuse me. Don't interrupt. Fucking. Many bore witness to her miracle. Y'all lying. It dawned upon me. Hey. Shh. But I wondered, what shrine should be her shelter? This time, why are you it was creepy, the Madonna bro? herself who answered my questions. She said, You shall build me a new church in Kingsbridge. So we set off with the blessing of Arch this guy talks a lot. of Canterbury. And along the road, from Paris, across Normandy, over the sea, and all the way to Kingsbridge. That's this guy right now. Devout Christians. Yeah, you've already said this, man. I don't. For the building of the Church of the Weeping Madonna. What is in this book will not help. Fucking. This there is much to contemplate. Of Kingsbridge. There's nothing else to click on. The weeping Madonna. Not Shut nice. up, bro. Explore surroundings. You, there you go. All of you. Okay. Oh my God, there's a lot of people here. Martha, hey. This guy got peacock feathers. This procession. He lying. They seem well intended. He lying. And we could use the money. Hmm. She is a true Do you speak English? Uh, no English, uh, no campandare. Uh, no, no, no. Hmm. Hey. Oh, what's this? I think you might have stepped into horse dung. What? Where? No, Haha. <laughs> no English, is it? Hey, Philip uh, Smart. Just un poco, uh, see. Si. Yeah. Could you talk to this man, Martha? Punch him in the yes, face. Yes, it's strange. He was quite talkative just a moment ago. <laughs> he told me he was from Damascus in Africa. You fucking liar. Isn't Damascus in Arabia? Oh, There's snap, no dog. Africa too, I, I'm sure. Why are you pretending you can't speak English? No English. Ah, Melada, Melada. Many bore witches. Strange animals. They They're trying to make it a camel? Horses. Smack the hump. She there you go. Hollow. go Feels like a wicker basket. Oh, look at him! Did you guys see Tommy? You don't need to be here, if it's too loud for you. You must wonder, why was King Brother Reynold. I've heard of a Reynold from the coast. Con man? A scheming drunkard who lives as a traveling monk. Uh -huh. You think uh -huh. that's... Uh -huh. Perhaps it is, perhaps it's not. Definitely. I don't trust him either way. Hey. She said. Shall build me a new church in Kingsbridge. So we set off. Tell me that he's not lying. Tell me. Tell me the truth. Why are you here? We are guardians of the Holy Virgin that sheds tears. We were appointed by the Archbishop of Canterbury. 
but it was the Holy Virgin herself who chose us while she traveled through Europe. Oh, yes. Mm. How did that happen? She speaks without words. I could have continued okay. to carry her from town to town until my flesh... <laughs> you peeking, yeah, you playing peekaboo? Have a good one, Lonnie. Thanks for hanging out, my friend. I appreciate you. Hopefully, uh, your internet chills out soon. What is in this book? Hey, kid. This time you must hey, buddy. Look at him. And his chonky belly. There is much to come. Oh, I want to say hello. Wait, did it? You heard me correctly. It was a long journey. Can I take off this cover? The weeping Madonna came to me Damn it, it's fine. Well, let me do it. Okay. He definitely lying. Okay, how we... Oh. How do we prove that he's lying? Did you have to walk all the way over there? My dear people. Oh, oh, I'm so excited to see a true miracle. Yeah, they don't Did care. You hear that? You lying? The Madonna has chosen us. She's come mm. all the way from Africa. Uh, um. It's fine. In the beginning, not I now. I okay. Had my faith. Examine the front. I knew not her powers or destination. Nevertheless. I carried her for many miles. You must wonder why was King's Bridge chosen? What am I missing, guys? She said, You shall build me. So we set off with the blessing of Archbishop. Pierre All I have is this Bible. I should have continued to carry her from town to town until my flesh succumbed. But this was not her. Please, will. everyone. Shh. We want to listen to his story. He fucking lying, bruh. I know he's lying. I just can't. This time, it was the Madonna Do I need to get him when he's peeking? Aha! I will tell you again, dear brothers and Don't you want to see the miracle? The Don't Madonna you want to see the miracle too? You, all of you. Are he adorable? Are you hiding? Now, why are you hiding? And hmm. Are you adorable? I have heard no, come back. That life has not That's not been fit for a shrine. Kingsbridge, but Nothing sacred about like this. Damn it, dog. And in dark ah. like these. Open up. In this book will not light shines bright. God damn it. And over the sea oh. And all the way I'm super zoomed out now. Can you feel it, brothers and sisters? You are about to witness a miracle. The Madonna knows how you have suffered. The I Virgin hate Mother this guy. Had to witness the rise and fall of her son, our Lord Jesus Christ, and never stopped believing. Kingsbridge has endured many hardships. Prior James left you before his time when you needed him the most. Your old cathedral was burned to the ground. How do you know this? And your new one collapsed even before construction was finished. You have suffered the ruthless destruction you of your market, have homes, and suffered. Lives. Okay, Father Time. Yeah. All of you. Have lost husbands, wives, and children, family, and friends. Ta -da! All of you know how it is to be hungry and afraid. Hey, yeah. friends. Aliena, How's it going, dudes? But this is a miracle, isn't it? Or something along those lines. You two getting back together oh. is. We thought it was time to give Tommy a home. And why are you rolling around boy, this fucking cheese bag? Boy. Well, Philip, do you recognize him? Our little Tommy? Look at his fucking clothes. I <laughs> love it. But... What is all this? 
Just what are you doing here? Yeah, that's what I want to know. These guys are assholes. People. Do you think I wouldn't notice it's all artifice? Your camels are horses. Mm. Your foreigners are English faking their accent. Your shrine is an old cart with decorations. And Reynold is just a dubious man. Yeah, dude. Speaking Come on. Lies. Remedius has Where is Nothing your good. honor? The camels were a bit much, weren't they? With the Madonna, we were able to collect donations for your priory and for Kingsbridge. Really? We can start anew. We can rebuild the cathedral. What's the catch? Mm. I'll get to be master builder. Why? What happened to I've Alfred? The cathedrals, churches, and houses they build in France and Spain. I saw how different their constructions were, with new shapes, colors, and ideas. Oh, you should have seen it. They combined rib vaulting and pointed arches. I want to do that. That's why. Why here? Because this is home. Mm. Yeah, I don't like that you guys are acting like shit stains. What you're doing is selling the people a lie. This is a harmless deception. There is no such thing as a harmless deception. It serves the same purpose as an illusion yeah, drawing in the Bible. Our show illustrates the truth that the Weeping Madonna comes from a faraway land, which it does. And she can weep too, though that is more of a technical achievement. You want to sell something explainable as a miracle. The church does the same. Are you doing, you so yourself. You even wrote a book about it. Oh, yes, I said that it was not right. Yeah, right. The church is faking miracles, but it works, doesn't it? Oh. Feel of a man of integrity. Hey, it's my Jack. sister. Aliena, you came back. We wanted to see you, little sister. Oh, how are you? Oh, I'm fine. But look at you. How did you not what just like one? run into someone's arms like that? How are the others? Right. Oh my God. Left you both dis disappeared for like Catherine two years. Shows up every now and then. And Ellen returned to the forest. We got to go see mom. To visit her. <clears throat> What's wrong, Martha? I'm glad you're back. I am too. Where's fucking? Very glad. What happened to Alfred? Did he die? Like she's about to cry. She will weep for your suffering, Kingsbury. Can we kick him? She knows your pain. What now? Ow. The miracle. Let me kick that dude. Her eyes are wet. <gasps> Why do you win your boutique? She is made of wood. It's impossible. <gasps> Why are you weeping? She is mute ever since her husband died. Oh shit. The Madonna has oh, shit. as I have. She understands. <laughs> Hello. Okay. It seems through her faith in all of your lies. She got her voice back. Oof. Mary has found a miracle. We can't keep trying to repair Kingsbridge by ourselves. Things are not improving. We're struggling to keep things as they are. Just mama things. Can't afford to hire help. Without farming and fairs, we're back to prior James's time. All these past years, my advice was good enough for you. But it appears you've changed your mind now, again. Oh, it's a grunty giant. Doing something <clears throat> to wake up and make Kingsbridge what it used to be. We did before, and we can do it again. I'm not willing to accept a risk. Like you just that. need to leave. Don't you remember what happened last time? My, my, how easily we forget. God, you're a dick. I remember well. And still, you put your trust into a group of random strangers to make things better. Philip, why in God's name have you stood by and let this happen? They're tricking us into giving them money for false idols. They are giving us money. 
So that we'll place this idol in our priory? Do you approve of this? Hmm. Oh boy. He's a man of integrity. Condemn deception. No. I don't approve of their deception. The Madonna is a trick. No miracle. Oh shit. But the people have already decided. And I won't... <sighs> That's gonna bite me in the ass fun. again, but he's a man of integrity. Did you not see what happened to Mary? I saw... And I see that you intentionally turn a blind eye to the lies of your friends. Ah, yeah, shit, dude. I'm warning you. Ah, yeah, shit, dude. I cannot support a prior who tolerates heresy. Ah, yeah, shit, dude. Your threat Point. won't sway me. No matter how unconventional, their return and their gift are a blessing. You made your decision, Finneth of Gwyneth. And now, I make my... Ah, shit, dude. I resign. Okay, get the hell out of here, bro. We wanted you to leave from the beginning. That's totally fine. Get the fuck out of here. You're gonna tell people, but fuck off. At least you're gone. Ugh, that guy was an asshole. Mom is using Jada as a pillow. You got so big, Tommy. <laughs> and you're just as shy as your father was. Oh, it's mom! Don't let him fool you. Usually, he's always up to something. Dang, she's still pretty. Tom would have been proud of you. Of both of you. Is she still here? Hmm? Tom's wife. Oh, no. Martha and I moved her to Kingsbridge. She's with Tom now. He always wanted that. Tom's wife? Ellen, we found Jack's family. Oh, oh, the body. In Sherborg. The place he came from wasn't Sherborg, it was Sherborg. But, really? What were they like? They were good people. His grandmother said Jack looked just like him, like his father. He does. They never came for him or, or asked about him. They thought he was dead. His ship sunk. He'd always wanted to go to England. Have you ever heard of the white ship? Yeah, just grab yeah. little grabby no. hands on her cape. The king's family drowned. My father was there. Is there he room was on the that? One who survived. Not for long. You told me that he was accused of stealing a chalice. Yes. But I know he was innocent. I heard the story and had to find out what he looked like. He told me his name. I fell in love. I helped him escape. But in the end, they caught up with us. You fell in love what happened by then? talking to him in the cellar? Whoa. They hanged him. I was there. He's a smooth talking motherfucker. You were there, Jack. Or he's hot they as hell. Born yet. Or both. He was led Lucky to the bastard. Gallows. Everyone was quiet. The people somehow knew he was not a thief. But I knew for sure. He told me. He was so afraid. He didn't want to die. I didn't want him to die. And I prayed. Then I heard his voice. Oh, oh no. Met, sang than really? Than ever. As if the falling melody Feel strip time toot toot and net this ever at dusk the hunter took oh. his prey the luck his freedom never oh, fuck I hate it no. No. <laughs> you said that three men were responsible for father's death. Who were they? <clears throat> the like sheriff that. of Shiring. I was fucking Percy right. Hamley, Prior James of Kingsbridge, and Archdeacon Whaler and Bygod. 
Prior James? Are you kidding? Oh, wait. Neither did I. He's the guy that's disappeared or dead. I knew. I curse you. All of you. I knew the Wailerin was one of them. You. One day you will be judged for what you did. Your houses shall be consumed by fire. Your life shall end in pain Look how and agony. Fucking smug. Asshole McGee is. And regret. Don't like that. The people they killed will return to haunt them. The people they killed will return to haunt them. Sing that. We welcome our new prior, Remigius. Wait, oh, there's Alfred. We found him. He helped to recover the bones of the saint of Kingsbridge, Adolphus, from the hands of thieves. Adolphus already rests safely in this great cathedral of Shiring. Our master builder, Alfred, promised me that it will only be a matter of a few years until the cathedral will be finished. And the Earl of Shiring has promised to support us. But he God, has that not piece. Done Both so those pieces of shit are still dead. Or no, still alive. The Earl is not a selfish man. Mm. His mother, Lady Hamley, is sick. More and more, I feel the whole of England is suffering from a sickness. Yeah. The sickness you. of war, poverty, and most of all, heathen beliefs. I have spoken to God. I'm sure you have. I asked him, begged him to walk amongst us, to heal us. But God I, hope you I hope you choke on your own vomit. Only when this great cathedral is finished will he have a temple to reside in. No matter the cost, this shall be a towering castle to protect us from evil and false belief. This cast protection from good and evil. Done. With this cathedral, we will bring an end to the dark times. It's like level one spell. Wailer and by God. Jack, what are you doing here? Yeah, motherfucker. Let's go. Your hands, Wailer Let's go. His name was Jack Sherborg. How dare you talk to the bishop like that? I'm gonna fucking he punch him. He died right here. Who are you? I know that man. He's that bastard from Kingsbridge. Shut up, you. That man is my husband. Yeah, get him. You. All of you. Yeah, look at this. Listen to what we have to say. The from quad of on, kill Kingsbridge mongers. I don't fucking know. We squadding up, though. Knights, by our walls. And by the word of the king. So whatever you do, we will defend our town. Yeah. Our market and fulling mills. And our cathedral, which we shall rebuild. All workers are invited to come and work for us. <laughs> Preposterous. If you so much as try to bring harm to us, Bishop, we will make sure that you Hell pay yeah. for everything you did. Let's go. Yeah! Confront the assholes. Help Jonathan plant a new tree. Yes. You've held your first sermon in a long time. You disapproved the deception of Madonna, but came to see that it gives people hope. Uh, Aliana and Jack have returned to Kingsbridge. Let's go! Yeah. Come heck with us, right? Chapter 17. Let it be an actual storm and not a bunch of dudes coming to wreck my castle. 1154. It had been three years. Three years of drought. Oh, shit. Three years of hunger oh, shit. and poverty. England was brought to its knees. Oh, boy. Only our walls had kept us safe from the bands of outlaws raiding towns and villages.
Bishop Waleran and William Hamley forced the workers of course to they did. the cathedral in Shiring. Then he died because they're Many assholery. Died. Oh, your boy called it. The work on our own cathedral had almost come to a halt. It's stinking pretty though. For four weeks, the storm had raged on. Holy shit. It was then that our cathedral gave up its last secret. It's not a cathedral at all. And everything changed. My eyes like twitching and it's driving me nuts. Oh, do I gotta bury my friend? I don't think you would have liked the sight of this. Uh, his voice is different. I don't think you would have liked the sight of this at all. He's gonna have a beard. Hmm. Looks like he's going like, oh heavens, but he's blocking out <laughs> the know. sand. Plan the cathedral to be that high. Did they get? I reinforce the walls like in Saint Denis. Okay, there's his voice back. The storm shouldn't be that much of a problem. But if it's not the storm, then what is it? These walls about to collapse. Why? Storm vaulting. Wooden beams. Tools. Right, I'm gonna grab these. Hammer and chisel. Oh shit, dog! Yeah, I'm gonna step away from that. The vaulting is cracked. Yeah. Mm, no, I don't want to break more stones loose. The roof looks all right. One day, people will fly like birds sailing on the wind. Rashid told me. Okay. Uh. If I make it worse, then we'll at least know what the problem is. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, please don't fall to your death, dude. Please don't fall to your death. Oh. 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 Shit, I fucked it up. If the vaulting were unstable, this part would have collapsed and the wall would retract. Okay. Oh wait, no, I didn't fuck up. The cause of the problem is not up here. Okay. Tom. What did we do wrong, what Tom? You have done now. When we erected the eastern wall ah, 17 said erected. years ago, there was also a crack. Yes. No matter what we did, it always came back. Is the ground shifting? But this is not the same wall. We rebuilt it. But the cause could have been the same in both cases. Stones, the ground, the cloister, the crypt. The crypt? Huh? Yes, Tom, you kept the whole foundation there as it was, but it never had to carry this much weight before. That's it. The problem must be down there. Let's go figure it out. They were enraged. Oh, look at Jonathan. Bishop Henry thinks that the Pope should hear about Oh my God, Philip is all gray. I think so too. I would be honored if he read my book. Oh. Philip. I really am worried about you. There is no need for you to worry, Jonathan. It is just a book. The oh, my tree. My tree grew that much in 11 years of things. And what you wrote, even though most of them can't read. Your book is being copied in priories all over England. Nice. Is that not a good thing? If our message oh, me. gives people hope. In desperate times, hope can be a powerful force. 
fact is very true. Well, I fear the bishops. They might come to believe you took that power from them. Huh. Do you? Philip's second book, The Divine Soul. He wrote another one. In his text, Philip suggests that we all carry a godly spark within us because God created man. And while sometimes it may seem as if God has abandoned us, God is indeed always closer to us than anything else because our soul is of a divine nature. This means that man does not have to wait for salvation from the outside, but we all can change the world around us ourselves. We can plant a seed and God in turn will make it grow. Philip's message of hope is heard in all of England and even other parts of Europe. But the church is highly critical of the text. In his first book, Philip had only criticized fake miracles. Now he seems to claim that as all men are equally divine, members of the clergy are not closer to God's glory than any other men. Yeah, that's going to piss him off. Absolutely. Why would that be the cause? Uh... Gotta go to the crypt, yo. What's up? Have you been atop the cathedral during the storm? Uh-huh. Don't worry, Philip. I ain't no the bitch. Storm isn't as bad up there. You shouldn't be up there risking your life. You should be with your children. Oh, I have another kid. Sally and Tommy have been asking for their Name's parents Sally. all morning. We got a family. Oh, look, cat face. He's going gray too. After their promise to Whaler and to keep Kins or Kingsbridge pr protected, Sir Caface and Jack have spent much time fortifying the town. Since then, William Hamley has not dared to attack the town again. Aliena, who has continued her wool business, trades mostly outside of Shiring. Most of the place she is trading is produced in Kingsbridge, where Jack erected two felting mills. Hell yeah. Aliena and Jack have two children now. Tommy is already 12 years old. His little sister Sally is nine. Martha looks after both of them while Jack and Aliena are working. Oh, that's nice. The we got a nice little family dynamic here. Wall apart. If the storm works, I work. Jonathan, did you and the others come directly from Winchester? Yes, we did. Have a point. What about Aliena? She stayed a day longer for the fleece fair. She should be on her way back now. In this storm? We didn't expect it to get worse. No one did. Four I'm weeks sure of storm, that's crazy. One. I need to go. I think I know why the East Wall is unstable. Yes? Why is that? I'm not sure, but I, I think the answer lies down in the crypt. I should hurry before it's too late. I'm gonna get a cathedral collapse on my head, aren't I? Okay. Uh, I think the crypt is this way. No. What the fuck? Apparently I gotta go this way. Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's not the way to the crypt. <laughs> well, let me do it anyway. Okay. Can I observe these? I don't like the look of that. I don't like it one bit. Not one bit. Ah, I don't like that. Tink, tink. That'll do. Shit. Here we go. I'm definitely gonna die. I'm definitely gonna die. Oh boy. Ah! God, he's crazy. Did I find something? Hidden tunnel? Secret tunnel! Secret tunnel. Stones, they, they've been removed before. Whoever put them back just added some mortar on top of the stones to hide the fact that they were removed. The tile at the bottom was completely loose. What does that mean? I think it was an entrance. An entrance? To where? That's what we'll find out. Uh oh. Careful Bruh. now. Yeah, dude, don't touch nothing. You've got the whole east wall on top of you. Uh huh. Um, don't fucking Jack. Jack. Stop. I'm all right. I just hit my head. Dude, pay attention. It's dark in here. 
Yeah, get a torch. There's a whole room here. A, a chamber. I'll get a torch. Philip, I'll get it. You stay here. Uh oh. Sand, coffin, brush, wooden cup. It's long. It's strong. Time to get the Princeton on. Got a brush. It's, it's made of leather. It's, oh, it's a whip. Oh, it's a sex dungeon. What is that doing here? What's a whip doing here? Yeah, why did it go from a, a brush to a whip? That's not wood. It's and why do we say it's a wooden cup? What the fuck? Gold, even. The chalice? Philip knows what this oh, is. shit. Is that the chalice that my dad stole? Is, is that a, a coffin? Oh, there's sand everywhere. Uh huh. It's a, a bed. What? What the fuck? I'm very there's confused. There's a bed in here. What? Jonathan, we need that torch. I have the torch. All right, come in here. Should be safe. Did you know about this place? No, no, I did not. I have seen this chalice before when I was very young. It's the chalice of the Eucharist from Kingsbridge Cathedral. Is that the chalice my dad stole? <clears throat> yep. Cuthbert told me about it. They said it was stolen. And melted down, I know. Mother told me. They also said it was my father who did it. It was James. So he's innocent then? He must be. Whoever hid the chalice is responsible for his death. They hanged him in Shire. It was a uh, prior, er, prior James. This chalice. But it was here all along. That scourge, the whip. It belonged to Prior James. I was afraid of it when I first visited Kingsbridge with Francis and Abbot Peter. Even the look of it scared. James. Maybe it was him. I think I saw him during the night. Of yeah, the I was gonna say he was the guy the in the fire, the cathedral. The that was like, forgive me. Down. There was a man in the fire. Yep. His shoulders yep. were bloody, as if he had chastised himself. It is you. Yep. By God and the devil. He told me that he had sinned, that he had done something to me. Perhaps because I That's like why. Yep, because I look like my dad. So he confessed for framing your father while he hid the cup here. But it couldn't have been James you saw. James died weeks before the fire. Mm -hmm. Did he? You said they never found his body. Mm -hmm. Maybe he hid down here. Maybe that's why the bed's here. Wait. Jack, you were in the burning cathedral. Oh shit. What were you doing there? Ah oh, shit, dude. Definitely not burning it. I did it! Ah, I'm a good man, I've been reading it. I burned it down. I shit. And then I told Philip what I'd done. He just looked at me. He didn't say anything. As a child, Philip was afraid of Prior James' scourge. He first saw it when he and Abbot Peter, the man who raised him and Francis after their parents were killed, visited Kingsbridge. Years later, James decided that Philip, now a young man, should get the chance to lead his own priory cell. St. John in the Forest Every time Philip visited the mother house in Kingsbridge, he always remembered the day he first saw the scourge. Abbot Peter did not like the idea that pain could lead to salvation, but Prior James believed that chastising oneself was the only way to cleanse the soul from the sinful implications of the flesh. After Jack told Philip that he believed Prior James was alive the day the cathedral burned down, Philip remembered that only weeks before 
There is a typo. The choir did not dare to sing because they thought they heard some chastising... Some chastising himself. Is there another typo? It should be someone chastising himself in the tip. In the crypt. Maybe they really did hear James. Maybe James did hide in the secret room in the crypt. But why? Look at him getting a chonk. Much easier to stab. What do you want? Do you think it is Got him like a pig. Ugh, speaking of pig. Times like these. There's one over there. While your people starve on the streets of Shiring. Because he's a piece of shit. Don't play the saint. You promise them miracles. And you make them pay. But your miracles never work out, do they? God works in ways that we cannot comprehend. That makes it really easy to just My schluff things walk. off. You failed. Again. What do you want? I came about a book. The Bible. Again. He came about a book. Uh, being a monk, you shouldn't be reading those kind of books, bruh. Bishop Henry was enraged. This is our chance, William. Your chance, you mean. If you need forces, talk to Walter or Ugly. I don't care. I built your fucking cathedral. I'm done. You just have rotting food everywhere. It's not just about Philip. It's about Aliena and her family. Don't mention that name. But have you not heard? King Stephen and Maud's son just signed a peace treaty. Oh my treaty. god, Waylorin is such a I dick. Don't care. You should care. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I said I don't. Now leave and don't come back unless I ask for you. Cool, hopefully their <laughs> stupid little allegiance falls apart here. Where's my wife? They've not returned yet, Lord William. Then get me a whore! Now! Jeez, God, how awful would it be married to that piece of shit? I'm so scared to change my input for even a minute to download the Resident Evil 8 demo. Change your input? What do you mean your input? 11 hours to download Resident Evil 8 demo? Oh, the PS5 is hooked up to your monitor. Okay. That's still bananas. Also, are you, you fully prepared to get stepped on? I told a bunch of friends today that uh, that demo came out on Steam. Also, it's out available on Steam if you just want to play it on Steam. Um, And uh, everyone's like, oh, yeah, God, yes. After over 15 years of civil war, the battle between Stephen and Maud, England was more divided than ever. After a final confrontation of at w Wallingford, Empress Maud's son, Henry II, and Stephen arranged a truce. The treaty was later signed in Winchester and Westminster. According to the treaty, Stephen will remain king until his death and then be succeeded by Henry II. The treaty further states that all decisions regarding land which were ever during Stephen's reign are immediately reverted and restored to the king time of King Henry I. This means that the earldom of Shiring again belongs to the heirs of Bartholomew and not to the Hamleys. But who dared to go against Hamleys? Oh, yo, let's go fuck him up. Yep, yeah, I got released on Steam today. I think I'll download PC so I don't possibly miss the al alpaca. <laughs> yeah, get it on PC. Plus, you know, better quality. I mean, PS5, yes, but PC graphics, you know. I have coin for the road. Something happens to her, I riot. Let's take shelter in that house. Is that the house of my aunt and uncle that burned down? Whoa, big wind. PS5 has better GPU than your PC. True, but still, there's, uh, PCs still can render more polygons and shit. 
Hello. Knock knock. Okay. Whoa. A lot of people are in here. Is this an inn? I am sorry for intruding. <laughs> nope, I, I just walked into someone's house. I was on my way from the fleece fair in Winchester to Kingsbridge and got caught in the storm. Nasty, isn't it? Yes. And it's getting worse and worse. I don't like the hooded dude back here. He's got me worried. Thank you for your hospitality. <sighs> Someone, help me. Oh, I hate this. Oh no. Please. I need help. Blanket door, pot, fire. Peasants. Rugged peasant, old woman. Fuck, I hate this. Smoke, door. Oh, I hate this. Let me help, let me help, let me help, let me help, let me help. Where are you? Hello, 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 hello. You were right there. Just get up and walk. Let's go. Oh, oh dear. Are you hurt? She's not a deer. She's a child. My horse. It fell. Oh, is that the horse shadow? Oh, poor horse. Take my hand. We'll get you inside. Okay, she's not a child. We'll only be here until it's safe to leave. We won't bother you. Oh my god, everyone just staring at us is freaking me out. I'm Aliena. What's your name? Elizabeth. I'm covered in Elizabeth! Elizabeth. You're safe now. Mm-hmm. We would all be better off without someone like her. Is this going to be Hamley's wife? Here, take my cloak. I'll hang out by the fire. Some meat blanket. I'm going to take this for a minute. Smells like horse. It's fine. But what are you going to do with that? I'm going to warm up. I'm just going to borrow it. Let's try to get along until the storm passes. Uh-huh. I don't like this. Why? Hold your horses. We'll see what happens. I hope the storm spares your homes and fields. Oh, I don't like this. If only we had that much left. We still have our lives. I don't like this. Am I going to get murdered because they're going to think I'm allied with her? You still have yours. <laughs> this guy just fucking in the poncho freaking me out. We don't have much. She doesn't deserve anything. Yeah, why? Take a bowl and go ahead. Thanks. She's avoiding eye contact. Why? Uh You should get out of this place as soon as you can. Be what? assured I will leave as soon as the storm ceases. I'm freaking out, dudes. What's going on here? Thank you. Hey, that's our blanket. No one was using it. Fuck off. Can't you see? She's freezing. It's all right. It's just a blanket. See, the old lady's cool. Oh, shit. She's hungry. The old lady said we could feed her, so. No. They don't deserve our kindness. Why? 
Why? Grandma said I could have it, so fuck off. Please don't get myself killed. Grandma said I could have it. Fuck off. Grandma said it so. Let her eat. Yeah. Listen to Grandma. Uh, thank you. Can I talk to you, please? Eat this. You must be hungry. Now warm me up too. Thank you. That's nice of you. Why are you giving her soup? Shut the fuck up. Dirt. That's what she deserves. Why? Explain. What? Do you want her to stop? Explain. Please don't start a fight. Listen, to Grandma. Oh, you're so kind. Many people would have let me die. Why? People don't listen to me. My entourage didn't even notice they lost me. Who? My husband and his entourage. Dude, it's fucking oh, Hamley's wife. I'm calling it. You have. I divorced my last one for less than that. <sighs> Divorce? Oh, he's just been beside himself ever since his mother. Called it. Maybe now you'll understand what loss feels like and what you people are doing to us. Called it. Stop bullying her. Can't you see she's upset? <laughs> How do they know you? This isn't right. Oh, I'm used to it. I guess that's how it is when your husband holds an office like that. He has to do a lot of things people don't like. Yeah. And sometimes they recognize me, too. Yeah, she's gonna be like, you're married to William Hamley? Is your husband the Earl of Shiring? Is your husband Hello, the Earl of Shiring? Friend. I thought you knew. Yes! Oh, we called it. William What's up, Citric? Hamley. Welcome to the stream. How you doing, my friend? Cookie Please don't time. abandon me, too. Cookie time! I, I swear, I'm not... I, I, I <laughs> Moira. Here goes a cookie. Um. Hey, do. Why did you marry him? I used oh, land right in front of her face. See if she'll wake up to get it. Really? Yeah, I was supposed to marry him, Why and I get the fuck out. Him? My parents arranged it, and it was an honor to be picked. What's he like now? He's a piece of shit. I loathe him with all my heart. Yeah, join us. How do you know him? Be diplomatic. I'm gonna be blunt. He's a piece he of shit. He wanted to marry me when I was your age. Apparently, he likes young girls, no matter how old he gets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You too were supposed to marry him. How come you didn't? Because he's a piece of shit. He was a beast. So I refused. He, you refused him? I sure did. It caused a lot of misery. Oh, you're, you're so courageous. I wish I was like you. I, I can't even stand up to the servants. Don't act like you didn't have a hand in the downfall of this land. For years, he roamed across the country to raise. Trigger word, by the way. Kill. I'm sorry. He's no Earl. After all, he's taken from us. We should take something from him, too. You fucking leave her alone. I will murder you. I still have she my stab has stick. Nothing to do with this. Don't you dare touch her. Yeah, fuck off. Can't you see? She's another one of his victims. I will stab every one of you. <laughs> I'll give over. She's in on it too. Get close to him. Watch what happens. Even imagine how it must be to be a child married to Hamley. The abuse and the humiliation every single day. I'm so sorry. I'm crying. 
because you know too enough to know your oh dude i'm ready to fucking throw hands right now i just i just don't know what to do anymore i'm protecting this girl with my life oh it's oh shit Walter. almost broke my He's keyboard for me. cool let's murder him give her the dagger oh shit come with me to kingsbridge come with me to kingsbridge people will take care of you there that should do it don't you guys fucking oh shit walter shit you I've not seen you in a long no, time. No, 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 no. William would be very pleased if I brought him your head. Oh, fuck. No! Don't harm her. If it wasn't for her, I'd be dead. She saved me from the storm. Oh! Did she now? Come on, we have to get back to the castle. We've lost too much time already. The girl stays with me. Fuck off, you. Elizabeth stays with me. Oh, shit, guys. No, she doesn't. Thank you for saving me and protecting me from these people. Come on now. We need to get going. No. William is waiting. No. 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 No, 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 was that my rejection that bittered William to the prospect of marriage of the years that followed? Was I the reason he married? So late after I met Elizabeth, I later found out that she was the daughter of the Herald of Weymouth, a wealthy knight and supporter of Stephen. Elizabeth was only 14 at the time of the wedding. Oh, that's fucked. Bishop Whalerin wed them in the Cathedral of Sharing, and everyone of importance was invited to the large feast. Elizabeth was, the, Elizabeth was a gentle girl who probably felt honored to be chosen become the earl's wife i dare not imagine how william treated her yeah that mm, one more reason to finally put an end to all this yeah i need to i need to murder the shit out of him he just added he just keeps adding fuel to his funeral pyre murder the shit out of him uh, i did not like how that that chapter ended on a secret chamber you confess philip that you burned down the cathedral philip's book is strongly criticized of course it is the war between emperor's mod and king stephen has ended that's good you found elizabeth has it was only after you entered the hut. You brought her some soup. You helped warm her up. You kept quiet while Walter entered the hut. No, I didn't. I said, fuck off. Oh, please don't tell me he took her. I was ready to throw down. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it. It's fine, though. It's fine. It's fine. All right. Oh boy. All right, my friends. Um, let's see. Um, oh god, I did not like how ending on that chapter. That was the pressy spaghetti or something. I don't fucking know. Uh, Boopy snoots. Snoot boobies. Hey, my snoot boop. I got him. I got him. I did you just sign him for? Boop snoot. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, you get no sign him. Yeah. All right. My friends, I think this is where we're going to have to call it for tonight. But I do think one of my friends is streaming. She just started streaming. She's a wonderful bean. I know her personally. And uh, if she is, we we'll might go send her some love. Gimmick is also streaming. We love her. Um, It looks like, dang, she only streams for like an hour. She's not streaming. Bummer! She started like uh like 45 minutes after I started to stream. But uh looks like she's not streaming anymore. Oh wait, she is! Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We're gonna we're gonna definitely go on a raid. Stick around, we'll go show my friend some love. She's a cool bean. She's playing some Valorant. I don't know if that's your guys' cup of tea, but she's awesome. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Let's get your raid nurses out and ready. Get some channel points when you guys stick around. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I hope you guys had fun. If you guys did, remember to like, subscribe, comment. Helps me out a lot. Let's me know what you're liking and what you're not liking. But more importantly, remember to spay new to your pets. Adopt, don't shop. Donate to rescue if you can afford it. Or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and races out that are very much in need. Anyway, I'm basic.
this morning is drive his mom is passed out as you can see there thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and i'll catch you guys next time see ya come on let's go Thank you. I appreciate it.